Hello everybody! This is a Yanni Mood Moment. Moments are just time for me to just talk about fun stuff, you know? I mean, not that all the other stuff I talk about isn't fun, but just light stuff. That's what I'll call it. Just some light stuff, some, you know, few little personal details, some things, you know, that I've liked and done and, you know, had fun with, that kind of thing. You know, just a little bit about life that I have lived. All right, so we're gonna get right into it. This particular video is my top five favorite girl groups. Top five favorite girl groups. All right, okay. I, you know what, growing up, I mostly listened to soloists, um, but there were some girl groups that were pretty impactful on my life. Number one is gonna be the Supremes, of course. Queen Diana, yes. My favorite songs by them were Baby Love and You Keep Me Hanging On. Yeah, anyway, yeah, Supremes. All right, number two, Sister Sledge. Sister Sledge, first of all, I look at the picture of them. Every single one of them is, they're beautiful. I mean, I, I used to, when I was younger, I was like, man, how is it that every sister, they, first of all, they have they, their own look, although they all look alike, and they were stunning, stunning, and they were just some beautiful sisters that were just very inspirational, you know, even their story. Look them up. Read about their story, where they came from. All right. Um, my favorite songs by them were um, We Are Family and He's the Greatest Dancer. Okay, We Are Family. You probably hear that at cookouts and family reunions and stuff like that. <laughs> Barbecues and, and things like that. Um, He's the Greatest Dancer. Love that song. It re-emerged when Will Smith used it. Um, in his album, I think the album was called Big Willie Style. I think so. Um, love that album, by the way. Um, and he used it on um, Getting Jiggy With It. Yeah, um, Getting Jiggy With It is actually from the Sister Sledge. It's a sample from Sister Sledge's song, He's the Greatest Dancer. Okay, just in case you didn't know that. All right, number three, In Vogue. Yeah, <clears throat> they were definitely a power. You know how the Supremes were like iconic in that they, um, you know, they were fresh. They were African-American for one, and they were, they just held a position of power because of that time, okay? Um, I think the same thing about In Vogue. There have been other girl groups before them, but it's like their emergence was significant in a different way. It, they almost represented a sort of renaissance of girl groups. I can't really explain to you exactly what that means. Um, because I'm thinking about it now. It's not something that I've actually fleshed out um, before. But now that I'm thinking about it, yeah. They, they, re they represented a type of uh, renaissance in girl groups in Vogue. <sighs> yeah. My two favorite songs by in Vogue were Hold On and Don't Let Go. That Don't Let Go, whew. I know Hold On was really popular, um, and I loved it too, just like everybody else, um, but particularly um, Don't Let Go, Don't Let Go, You Have a Right to Lose Control, Don't Let Go. Anyway, yes, I think that was a part of the Set It Off soundtrack. It was just really dramatic and deep and haunting. Yeah, I love that song. All right, um, let's see. Number four, TLC, of course. 
who didn't love TLC? Um, I didn't necessarily like all of their music, you know, because they they were kind of, you know, they went to a level. Yeah, I guess all of them did at some point. I was just drawn to particular songs. My favorites were um, Waterfalls because I thought that it was um, um, a song that um, talked about some really relevant issues. Um, issues that I could get with. Um, and also, the, one of the other songs that I love by them is um, a song that they've done lately called Meant To Be. I love that song. I think Neo um, produced that song for them. Neo, phenomenal songwriter and producer, by the way. Um, but anyway, it's called Meant To Be. I like that song. It ain't gonna be easy. Because mm. no matter what, baby, we're meant to be. I love that song. I really do. I think he did a great job. They did a great, great job, and it subsequently became um, one of my favorite TLC songs. Yeah. Um, yeah. Even without um, the late, great Left Eye, Lisa Left Eye Lopez, rest in peace. Rest in peace beautiful soul okay all right and then finally um in the fifth spot it's a tie it's a tie between 90s r&b girl groups brownstone and jade there's a tie they're really equal um my favorite song by brownstone was um if you love me if you love me say if you love me do it something like that i can't remember all the words yeah um and then jade was don't walk away don't walk away boy yeah they're tied for number five i could not leave one of them out so they will share the fifth spot brownstone and jade and we're finished. We are finished. That was fun, right? Yeah, it was. Let me know what your favorites are. Who are your favorite girl groups? Leave them below. Tell me what you think of my list. Maybe what your favorite songs by those same people are. That would be fun. Yeah, let's do it. Thank you for joining me. I appreciate it so very much. If you haven't already subscribed, do so below. Turn on notifications so I can let you know what's coming next. And until next time, keep having fun.